Final Residence TV. Today I got a special product for you. You're gonna love this. This is the Eddie Van Halen Frankenstein replica stripe series. I know you knew that already, but I gotta tell you, this is one of the most amazing replica guitars I've ever seen, and the money that you can get it for is crazy good. I mean, when they came out with this at NAM and everybody got their hands on it, I was there. The first thing that everybody said is the neck, how great the neck feels, and that's no doubt. It's it's still like a Stripe Series neck, but it, it's wore a little bit, and it has that uh, finish on it. They, well, it's non-finished, but it has like a coating on it. They've, they've sanded it down and put this worn finish on it. It feels almost like baked maple, and it plays unbelievably good. <laughs> I am in love with this neck, and so many people at NAMM were too. Um, the neck is actually dark in certain areas, darker. It depends on the guitar, I found out. Of course, they're doing these all one at a time, so there are going to be variations on them um, a lot. you got to think, this is mass-produced, and how they do that, it just blows my mind. But everyone's going to be a little bit different. But the general DNA of this is amazingly like the original. In fact, I got this earlier today, and I hung it on a stand for a little while and just looked at it. And it was like looking at a photo to me, because I've looked at this guitar on photos my entire life and in fact I did get to see it in New York City last year at the big exhibition they had there where the Frankenstein was there and I'm inches away from the original you know standing there looking at it and I have looked at it so long so many years that, that I set it on a stand and it looked like the like a photo to me and it's this guitar so it's just an amazing likeness and the vibe is like it and it feels amazing um, let's look at the pickups. Wolfgang pickup in the back, a dummy pickup in the front, single coil, and the amazing switch that he took out when he decided not to rewire the switch and put it in the middle. That's pretty cool. Down inside there, it's actually dirted up with some stuff to make it look like it's been played forever. The uh, tone knob that was the volume knob, obviously that's the Van Halen thing. Floyd Rose in the back with a little bit of wear on it uh, against the body. You've got the um, non-painted tremolo cavity where uh, he likes to let the air breathe into the body through that open area. Um, there are some rubbed almost to the wood areas, but still has a little clear coat on it. Um, the neck plate is a pretty thin plate, which is interesting. The entire guitar feels thin and, and easy to play. It's easy to play, and the body feels it just fits. It's weird, but it's like a great pair of jeans, right? That's what people say, you know, a worn pair of jeans. And this guitar kills that. And not only is it that good to play, it's the Van Halen guitar that you've always dreamed of having. Amazing, amazing. You gotta have one. You gotta have one if you're a Van Halen fan. EVH gear, they rock. I've got a ton of guitars here from them and um, this is my 50th birthday present, my Wolfgang Striped. Then I got my 51st birthday present, my EVA Shark, and my 52nd birthday present. The guitar, the Frankenstein, and it's ready to go be played. I'm gonna take this thing out this weekend, and uh, I'm gonna play some Van Halen on it, of course, and next weekend I've got a great gig where I get to play Beat It. So I'll get to play Beat It and Jump on the guitar. <laughs> Dang, it's going to be cool. I can't wait to be on stage with this guitar and play and jump and play and beat it. And maybe even pan all that night. Of course, um, this guitar is so uh, iconic. You just got to you gotta have it if you're a Van Halen fan. If he was the guy for you, uh, you have to have this guitar. So anyway, let's get some playing done and let you check out the sounds. It's amazing. You're, you're going to love it and you're going to want it. And uh, thanks for tuning in 
to uh, Final Residence TV, subscribe and like the channel. And also check out the Van Halen playlist on my channel that has a lot of other content about Van Halen. I'm continuously adding to that as I do other things. In fact, next week I'm having an interview with Joel Holkstra of Night Ranger, White Snake, and Rock of Ages and all these other things he's done. And uh, I'll probably have to ask Joel a few questions about how Van Halen affected him so I can put him on the Van Halen playlist. So anyway, let's go check this guitar out. You're going to love it. Rock on.